plates aren't eating the A-Real guys. <laughs> and now you guys are wondering. We, we, we now it's out there. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yep. Let's go, baby. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. Right. Come on. Right. Push it, push it, push it. See, you guys? I knew Brad was strong all along. <laughs> uh, I never had any doubts. <laughs> PR lifestyle is more than just hitting a PR on the squat bench or deadlift. It's about being the best version of yourself, always improving. Come on, somebody out there sitting working harder than you. You versus you. Welcome back to the channel, guys. We are here at TG in Pacific Beach. This gym, I heard, has thousands and thousands of members. I was working one very soon in Claremont. I figured I'd check it out. Today we're here with Brad Casselberry and the yes. world's strongest CEO. Look, oh, Brad, you were my inspiration for a long time. I remember like a decade ago, seeing your videos, throwing up the super heavy weights, super heavy dumbbells, and being jacked while you did it. That's what inspired me, right, to do what I've done, right? I saw you with an absolutely fantastic physique, shredded, you know, lifting ungodly amounts of weight. I never thought you'd use fake weights. I always thought maybe the spot was helping a bit too much, you know? But I always knew you were strong, right? No matter what people have said online, I always know, knew that Brad was very strong. You can't look like this and not be strong, right? So today, <clears throat> this has been long overdue. Um, I don't think you've collaborated with anybody in the last few years or so, right? I haven't at all, actually, so I just kind of just staying low, just take care of the family, get my mind right, just get back on track. And just, uh, but I've been training hard, so it's going to be a good day for us. So I'm excited. And I, honestly, he's the same right here, dude. He's been an inspiration. Like, after the fact, of just seeing him do his shit, and it's like how he did it. It's like, he was like, like, like doing the same things as we progressed. It was just like, yeah. but at the end of the day, it's like people thought what they wanted, but I saw that it was just love. He's doing the same thing I'm doing. I had a, it was respect on my end. So, uh, yeah, way overdue right here. We're about to get it. We got arms today, baby, yes, in sir. San Diego. <laughs> What's well, about to go down, so I'm excited. And not many know this, but you're over 40 years old now. Right? Well, I'm 38. So, 38? Oh, yeah. Okay. Got a haircut today, fresh hat. Looks <laughs> <laughs> really good, yeah. Most definitely, most definitely. So. Well, all right, well, what do you want to start with? I know we're doing arms, right? So. Yeah, let's get maybe just some uh, tricep, bicep, warm up on the cables and just get the pump going, get the blood flow, and then we'll attack it. Let's see it. Let's, let's get it. I'm ready, man. Let's go. Oh, we're super setting this with, looks like reverse curls. <laughs> I'm about to ask him why in a second. How come we're doing reverse curls? How are we doing them? Uh, how come we're doing them? How come? Well, why are we doing them? Yeah. I was just warming them up to get the forearms. You prefer doing it reverse versus supinated? Uh, I, I do both. both. So I'm just doing this light to get us uh, pumping, to get us like the blood flow that we do attack something. Okay. Real easy. For me, it's like I always like to lean forward and then you just bring it up. Boom, yeah, bring to, oh yeah, look at that, that's way different. Oh, I see it now, for sure. Yeah, for your forehead. <laughs> Quality. Sure. No, this is sick as fuck. I love this shit, working out with this guy, dude. It's like, oh, dude, it's like, you know what I'm saying? I love it. A decade later. Yeah. A decade later. That damn nipple just stays out there. It's all about the nipples, oh, the nipples are right ones. A little cold today. <laughs> Cutting glass. <laughs> We're gonna hold this shit. called the Brett Kesselberg. Skin, we're just getting warmed up here. It's getting warmed up, you know what I mean? Small little tiny ripped guys. <laughs> and I was like, when they beat me, I was like, but I learned their style. Yeah. So I was like, rematch, rematch. <laughs> Took them the two next rounds. Dude, I've been humbled so many times by really tiny dudes. So many times, like Rahul Panicker. You guys know the video. <laughs> Today I was at the Zoo Culture anniversary, and there's this wrestler there. He's no more than five foot five, and he's like, "Ah, oh, I'll give you a hundred dollars if you wrestle me." Mm -hmm. And he's got the most 
extreme case of cauliflower ear I've ever seen. Or like, he's an Olympic wrestler. <laughs> this guy will destroy me. Hey, but, it's, but, hey, but it, like, it's fun to try sometimes and see what you got. Hey, Steven, my hamstring was working Oh, yeah, fuck that. With the injury. Hey, don't be doing things when you're injured. I heard that you were interested in getting the power with it. Yeah, I was uh, kind of. I, 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 like, I was like just talking about it. Honestly, I want to do the uh, I want to do uh, uh, bodybuilding. Bodybuilding? I'm not more, no, not powerlifting. Okay. I want to do bodybuilding. Right. I've owned this physique like the whole time, so it's honestly been, like wrong to go to the powerlifting when like the physique was the main goal the whole time I lifted. So I'd stick to the process and the, like, it would have to like, you know, I lifted heavy, but I would never like did the powerlifting. Right. I lifted. Right. It was just for fun. That, I li oh, I love lifting heavy. Right. So, but it's like, I wanted to sculpt my body the whole process. So. Like we'll get some shots later, and then you guys judge. You'll be like, what, what should we do? Bodybuilding, powerlifting. You know what I mean? I mean, <laughs> big answer is clear, even after yeah. right now. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. You got so the obviously, man. I mean, come on. So now. obviously, mm -hmm. like, like yeah. what? if I've worked this long for something, it's like, I've been, like, I was telling him I want to compete this year. Like, I saw what you did on the, uh, like, the, uh, the competition side this year, and it, like, inspired me. I was like, dude, that's where it's at. Olympia, maybe. Amateur Olympia. Yeah, dude. Because you're on the yeah. same stage as like the big dogs, so then the comparison, you necessarily don't even need to compete against the guys, that you have the same stage view, so then you can like, you can do a side-by-side -side comparison regardless. And then just for getting noticed, if you do it that weekend, everyone's watching bodybuilding yeah. that weekend. Oh yeah, like you fucking looked insane. I was like, fucking A, I gotta do this shit. I mean, hey bro, I'll be more than happy for you to come out to my gym over in Claremont and work with my coach and I, Ryan Benson. Claremont down here? Uh, in, well, LA, yeah, you live over here. Oh, no, no, Claremont. We have a Claremont right around the corner. Someone just told me that. Yeah. So, so the Claremont in LA. Oh, okay, no, I can cruise up there for like sure. Like an hour and a half from here to yeah. get here, so. No, that'll be badass. I think it'll be Close grip right here. Plates are indeed very real, guys. <laughs> I know you guys are wondering. Hey, we, we know it's out there. <laughs> we got validation. Actually, I'm the one with the Orca? It's like, we were trapped. It looks like an orca whale is laying down. But well, I'm the one wearing black and white, so we'll see. <laughs> Where's your blow hole? Huh? Where's your blow hole? Let's go, big dog. Here. Should we find it? <laughs> oh, by the way, guys, he can rip out six plates on the bench. Woo! <laughs> oh, it is cold in here, bro. <laughs> yeah, let's take a time to do one time. I think I cut glass. Cut glass. <laughs> cut glass. <laughs> Keep on. Yeah. Why is it? <laughs> you have to share, bro. Let me get some. Uh, that looks <laughs> like that. Come on, dude. Come swapping. Oh, what the fuck is that? Great, boy. Oh, dude. What is that? Look on your wrist. You go, oh, bro. Yeah. So how does our angling work? Is it when you stand this way and you do one of these? Pretty much. Or do you have to like stand on this side of the angle and just kind of do one of these? It's like <laughs> how, how, how does the our angling work? Basically, just make sure you're one foot in front of me towards the camera. Now you're like last twice second. as big as me. But now, now we're even. This now is a real comparison. Last second, you step in last second. <laughs> you gotta, you gotta, last gotta, second. Do you gotta like watch it. what the finger is doing behind the camera and time it. When the finger touches that, you just go. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's that's how the like, angle shit works. Okay. All right, Brad. Here we go. Let's go. Let's go. Yep. Come on. Come on. Beast Three. mode. Oh yeah. Three. Dude, your conditioning is not bad, even as it is right now. See the stretches to your chest and rotate and your shoulders. You don't have a long way to go from as you are right now. Yeah, you'll trip on my legs and hamstrings. Are they shredded? It's shredded. Take off your pants. <laughs> right. I think I have like the ultimate hamstrings in the world. Mm. He's got the great sweat on, he's teasing us. Let's get it. It's the, it's the, it's the, it's the, it's the left side. The bottom side is hard to hit. It's like, a, it, 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 it takes like a, a more understanding. Here we go. 
Vice President at Lone Bull. Probably one of the strongest Vice Presidents out there. I don't know. I sure as hell won't show up late to this guy's office. Probably five percent more. The, like on the push through, or like the. It gives you so much rebound on the bottom. Yeah, cause from your chest. I'd to rather play it safe. A little higher. Mm. Yeah. Why? Right there. Three, two. Breaking in, bro. What the fuck? Well, I can only use them with you. They're meant to be fucking used and abused. We'll use them twice a year, no problem. <laughs> We're gonna stay fresh. I just put on Yeah. Red. Perfect. Keep the wrist tight because this shit's fucking rolling. What's the that? Bar, the bar rolls. So keep the wrist tight. Here we go. Let's go, Get it. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Yep. Let's go, baby. Drive. Yeah. There we go. Light. Come on. Drive. Push it, push it, push Drive. it. Again. Yeah. Yeah. Get it. Get it. Get it. Come on. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Wait. Back to you. Oh. Woo. That was beast mode right there. Absolutely. Yeah, dude. Absolutely. Good job, See you guys? I knew Brad was strong all along. <laughs> uh, I never had any doubts. You can't look like that and not be strong. It's impossible. Yeah. <laughs> you can't get stronger and not get bigger. And you're a big as fuck. See, it's very rare to be lean and strong. Mm -hmm. See, I'm just strong, but I'm a little bit on the chunky side. Just a little bit. You're on the orca side? On a, little bit on the, a little bit on the orca whale side. I'm working on it. 10, 10, 15 pounds, I'll be okay. It's okay. Orca whale's an apex predator. That's true. That is indeed true. That is true. Three. Uh, woo! Great. You don't even need the hype up. Come on, yeah. man. Hey, we all need the hype up. Yeah, that's true. Two. Let's go. Let's go. Three. Three. Oh. Let's go. Hey, wait. Butter, baby! Like butter! Yes, sir! Fuck yeah, keep going! Fucking A, let's go! He's got it, he's got it! Let's go! 15, baby, let's go! 16, let's go! Get it! Fucking beast mode right there. 
We all need that hype up. Woo! We all need that shit. That's man shit. Too many people these days, man, they, they, they think that's like too much. No, it's not enough. We need more people hyping people up. You know what I mean? It's all about that teamwork, bringing everyone to a better place. We all start at different places. And it's about understanding that. So you want to help the next person what you've learned and shared to kick back to life. You know what I mean? That's how we grow. So it's just what it is. You want to go for it? Come on, man. What the yeah. fuck, dude? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep the circuit. Let's go. Yeah. Everyone needs to finish their run. Sure. Larry doesn't believe in me. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay. Three, two, right. Yeah. Let's go. Yo! Yeah. Hey! Let's go. Squeeze. Get it. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. So Let's go. Oh. Woo! <laughs> he got more. Uh oh. Yep. Pop off a little bit. Nice. Man. We breed beasts at Lone Vault. <laughs> oh, baby. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. How much do you weigh? 200. 200 pounds. Close grip, double body weight back. I want to get the 200, so that's a lot. Like 195, easy. I was going to see it. Damn, got it. Yeah. <laughs> All right. It's crazy when you got fucking this energy. Right. Let's go. Oh. Pump those weights. Oh. Let's get this shit. Oh. This guy looks oh, like the oh, Under Armour mannequin. Oh, oh. Did you see the Under Armour mannequin with authority? You ready to know? <laughs> You're dressed up in the hey, gym. Wait, wait, wait. We, we, are in, we are in San Diego, so, you know, sea roll down the street, baby. I jump in the wheel tank. You can't let's tell the go, difference. Uh, clips, please. Woo! Gains, baby! <laughs> throwback right there, having flashbacks. Gains. <laughs> oh, that's it's like the throwback songs, you know what I mean? You're like, okay, I'm feeling that. <laughs> We're from the past right now. Everybody vibes to it and everyone always knows the words. Don't, don't lie that you don't. We know you get back in the car. Let's go. Yeah, where's that song you gotta get? Yeah. Woo. Yeah, you can see yourself. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Let's go, rep it up. Easy. Got maybe like a 20 piece, got a nice pump. 20 right now, yeah. Yeah, that's a 20 piece, what do you say? Yeah, 20. 20 reps? 20 reps. <laughs> It'll be hard, but you got it. She likes it hard, man. Come on. She likes it hard. Do what she wants. Yeah. Stay hard, like David Goggins said. Stay hard, bro. Stay hard, bro. Stay hard. Honestly, I think staying hard is the best solution to anything in life. You got a problem? Stay hard. I'm hard right now. Oh, God. Hey, I don't know what you got around you, bro. Look what you got around you. It's expected. That's expected. No, no, white stuff on your hands. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Let's go, let's go, man! Come on! Yep! Yes, sir! Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. Hey. Come on! Yeah! Breathe! Breathe! Let's go! Hey! Let's go! Easy, Eight more, baby! Easy 
work. Come on. Fucking work right there. That's how you do it. Let's Ooh. fucking go. Ah. Wake up, here. Mm -hmm. Let's go, CNA 20. Oh, yeah. There you go. Five. One. Two. Let's go. Three. Four. Five. Let's go. One more. One. Two. Two. Three. Four. Let's go. Five. Five more. One. Two. Three. Four. Oh, ah. yeah. Game day, baby. Yeah. Right, let's go. Let them know they're ready. One, two, three. They ready know. Five, two, three, two, four, ten. Two, one, two, three, four, come on, fifteen. Five more. One, two, three. Get it. Four. Session of the day. <laughs> well, I think it's
Yeah. I like focusing on my eyebrows. Eyebrows? Yeah. How's that look? Is that right? A little further back. More? Yep. Right there? Yep, right there. I like that. Right on your eyes. Yep. A little deeper. A little deeper? If you're able to like that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, right there. Try and even go to here. Right here? Mm hmm. Like that, yep. Got it. Oh. Yep. Hey, grab that for me. Oh, you good? No, no, no. Yeah, that was gonna fuck you. Even the healthy other was gonna fuck it up. Sorry, I'm like, hey, Dave, I'm cool. Oh, I'm trying my best. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that was my set. Sorry, guys. Easy. Oh, we're putting another pen on your side, so don't worry about it. You can do that. Come up right here. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, you ready, Brad? Woo! set right here. Go right into it. Absolutely. So each one's one set. You know what? Uh, Lion's in his back. He's decently conditioned right now. Look at that separation right there. Crazy. Oh yeah. Oh, that's a good shot. So Brad, as I was saying, it's like we're going to my show, both shows. Test for two, three, climb. That's it. Clean diet too. And of course, well, nothing but air fried chicken, really. <laughs> no fat, salt, or carbs. What's your diet like? Tell them. Uh, honestly, it's the same thing every day. I just eat breakfast, egg whites. I, I do no powders, it's all raw foods. I don't believe in the powders. And then uh, bananas, egg whites. In the morning, they'll have a lunch, rice, and some kind of protein. Same meal at dinner. And then maybe a protein shake at the end of the day, the same one I had in the morning. Mm. Four solid meals. Each one's about 800, 1500 calories. So it's solid. It's funny that as you go through it, you guys do that. Oh, dude. Right? It is, right? It's funny. It's a hard machine. Yeah? It's hard. Shoulders a little This guy is teasing us with his gray pants. We're going to take them off, bro. I will. I'm going to break You guys are going to see those legs in a second. Yeah. I'll do it. Let's do it. Do they have a closing room here? Yeah, you know, this is it. This is it. Uh, huh? <laughs> my chest is fine. It's just my elbow. I did, uh, have you found that your arms thing. got yeah. bigger over the years? Yeah, yeah. Like a little bit thicker? Have they changed at all? You get thicker with mass, not necessarily like the bug. The, uh, I don't know. I've had my ups and downs, so it's like a roller coaster of life. So it's hard to say, like. If that had it, you know what I mean? Everything has to do with it. But I've been a solid year right now, and I'm like, came from, from, from taking a break from COVID, you know what I mean? I mean, now I'm on a solid full year, like, straight in the home with this guy, so. But I, they're like 20s, I would say, maybe. Yeah, so am I, 20. Yeah. I would say since I'm like 21 till now, they definitely got there. You you're, dude, you're way huge. <laughs> Brad, I want to ask you this. So, what injuries have you had, and what have you done to treat them? Um, what have you yeah, done, like elbow and shoulder, for example? Uh, honestly, it's about, uh, a lot of our injuries could be like this small, and the pain's like huge, like this, and the problem's like this big, it's like, yes. and so the smallest little thing people will like go and think it's like this whole thing, when it could be like just one tiny thing like down here, yeah. that's affecting the whole thing, and it's pulling tension on it. So for me, over the years, I've constantly massaged myself, body position, oh, posture, uh, stretching, a lot of going in uh, self-repair. You have to be your own doctor. You're never gonna take advice from some other person that doesn't know how you feel and honestly, like, or you can only tell somebody so much. And you should become your own doctor by their advice. So it's like, you learn from the people you speak to, don't just take their advice, you learn through it. 
So for me, being in, I'm like, I have no injuries, no tears, tears. Have I, I've, or I've pulled my calves. I pulled my calves. And my full leg was uh, like disconnected, but I fixed it myself with self-repair of like going in there and breaking up the scar tissue. So scar tissue will hold you back. So it's, if you do hurt yourself, make sure you, you right away go and attack the problem. If you let it sit and build up that scar tissue, you're gonna have like, that, that's a battle in itself trying to get rid of that. And that's what causes the problem because that scar tissue is sitting on a nerve as it moves. So you got to go in there and break that up. So then you have like no issues. So that's how I'm staying. I'm, I've, I've done this since I was 12 years old. I'm 38 years old. I'm still doing it. So it's like, I think what I'm doing works. If I'm still in here pounding that weight with Larry. I'm going to tell you this. Not many 38-year-olds look like this guy. So <laughs> that's good. Doing your prime bodybuilding year, some would say. <laughs> Lots of maturity here. Oh, yeah. oh baby, easy. Break the machine. Oh, yeah. I think it was 20. It's I think this is the hardest fucking machine I've ever lifted on. Really? <laughs> 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 I like it. I like this one. Yeah, we can go up. Yeah. I hit 20 right there, though. 20? You could probably I hit 20. Well, uh, the whole thing. All the way down there, you're two holes away from the bottom. I'll work my way up from the bottom. <laughs> that's the whole, that's the whole staff. <laughs> Holy shit. So, I get a small area right here. Yeah. Every time I see this guy's biceps, I'm like, how the fuck? Like, release it. Don't do anything. I got control. Sir. You're too strong, Master. I'm wearing PR. I have to do it. Sir. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you got it. <laughs> Stop, Bates. This guy's not active. I swear to God. The next Tom Cruise without action. Come on now. Sir. I literally can't. Woo. He's fucking active. <laughs> You did the 135 barbell curl for 27. That's 28. different. Is it? It's way harder. It's way harder. This is way easier. No, I don't know, man. <laughs> they call me Baby Brad. <laughs> <laughs> what are you wearing now? Like 190? No, 215. 215. 215. Yeah. 215. Hey, don't, hey, don't discredit this. <laughs> <laughs> we got 230 over here. I didn't see the legs. I didn't see the legs. <laughs> How about you wearing 160? <laughs> <laughs> hey, what are you wearing? Like, what are you wearing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Come yep. on, oh yeah. Oh, too heavy. Too heavy. <laughs> too heavy. Okay, now you I feel better. I feel better. This guy did it too. Easy. Rip out, rip out. Cut it, cut it half here. Aaron, put it on the three quarters. <laughs> I must have like some 20 reps. average. 20 reps, Brad. <laughs> We're doing the same way over there. 20, 20, yeah. baby. One. Oh two, yeah. Three. Oh yeah. Dude. Four. Five. Fuck yeah, dude. Six. Yep. Seven. So help me. Eight. Yep. Nine. Yep. Nine. See you. See you. Oh, Ten. Yep. Eleven. Grind. Grind. Thirteen. Yep. 14. Oh my God. This guy's gorgeous. Sixteen. Oh yeah. Oh, seven. Oh yeah. Eighteen. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Nineteen. One more. Yes. Come on. Yeah. One more. One more. Hey, 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 hey. Oh yeah. <laughs> Double biceps. Hey. Hey. Oh my God. You can't God. even flex. You can't. Jesus. <laughs> you flexed out. Oh God. Ah. Woo. I got you. I got you. <laughs> Stretch out, stretch it out, let's go. Let me count Arabic. Stretch it out. Wahad. Nin. Stretch it out. Get that pump, let's go. Let's go. Pump. All the way down, all the way down. Let's get down. Yeah, like that one. Do another one of those ones, like that one. Keep that form. Keep that form. That one. Keep that form. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Well, we at what number? I'm not counting. Okay, five, six more. All right, we're starting over. One, one two, two, three. All the way down. Four. Three more, Larry. Five. five six. Let's go, Larry. One more. Let's go. Oh. Only did eight. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. 20, 20, 20.
chest. Right, you gotta get on stage, boy. Backed up a bicep. Oh shit, huh? What the fuck? Nah, fuck that shit. <laughs> what are we doing? Backed up, backed up a bicep. Rear lat spread. Side triceps. Lean beef. That's a good shot. Overhead abdominals and thigh. Most muscular. Workout, you guys, right here down in, down in San Diego. Man, first time working out with these guys. I love this teamwork, people building each other up, hyping each other up. There's no competition out here, man. It's you versus you. So understand that, man. People are all come from different places. I've been doing this for over 20 years. So it's like I need to help people everywhere I go. I have a head messed up head sometimes. I'm mad dealing with life. Man, the gym, I come here just to. Release some steam, and a lot of people are. So you never know what someone's going through. Hype people up. Man, this is a team thing, fitness. It's not you versus them, it's you versus you. Because it's you have to do the work every day, so understand that, and just hype people up. Be positive energy for people, man. These guys invited me down here. We're trying to spread that love. And me and Larry, man, he's doing the same shit, pumping people up. It's the end of the day. Keep working hard, you guys. It's a new year. It could be a new you. You can change your shit like that. Get rid of the negative energy. Get rid of any of that stuff in your life that's not pushing you to the next level. And on that note, speaking of negative energy, this is why so badly for many years, I wanted to prove to the people in the fitness community that Brad is strong. You are strong. You did 405 for five reps in one close group today. Yeah. Right? We we're doing just about, no matter what exercise we chose today, the same weight. There's no fake weight. You know, and I've been preaching this to everybody off camera when Bradley Casper came up a while ago. You don't get a physique like this. Not pushing the not pushing your limits, not pushing the envelope, and not being strong. There's no way. It's exactly. Not you get it one without the other. And, and, and you guys know what's up, what he's talking about. All the people talking out there, people are always going to be talking. So don't focus on the negative energy. Don't focus on that stuff. You know who you are and be that person every day and don't change for nothing. And that's what I've stayed. I've stayed true to myself. I never switched up, never done anything against who I am as a man. Work hard, man, and boost other men up. That's what a real man does is bring men up. Anyone out there talking shit, man, you're not a man. So that's just the fact of life. So if you want to look in the mirror and you're bringing people down, you're a bitch. I couldn't have said it better myself. <laughs> and I think you're teasing the idea of jumping into bodybuilding. I've been saying for the longest time, you would absolutely crush in bodybuilding. You got great symmetry, great structure, lots of potential. Whenever you want to step on stage, I hope you 
consider working with Ryan Benson and I mm -hmm. going to your next show because if there's anything my coach can do right, it's get his, guy, his guys and girls condition, right? So if you want to come in that show being the one that's most peeled, mm -hmm. we can guarantee that. And we'd love to yeah. have some more training with you along the way. Yeah, to your show. yeah no, I appreciate that. Yeah. I think we're going to do that. So you guys heard it right there. We're going to do some big things this year, get myself on stage, you know what I'm saying? And a lot of things to come. And just so, hey, life is like this. It's a roller coaster. Number one thing, don't stop working hard. Don't stop just pushing those. It's little steps. That's all you got to keep doing. Keep the steps moving, you guys. And I believe in you guys, man. We're, we're, we speak right here. We're doing it every day. These aren't big steps, man. This is consistency over time. Nothing is done overnight. And you got to understand that. Look in the mirror and tell yourself that every day. And just keep working hard, you guys. Game day, baby. San Diego represent. Oh, yeah. We'll see you guys very soon in the next one. Boom! Let's go! Oh. Boom, baby! <laughs>